As another round of COVID-19 boosters will soon be going into the arms of millions of Americans who are now eligible. The CDC giving its recommendation shortly after the FDA gave the green light for that booster shot. NBC4's Eric Halpern is live in Columbus tonight. And Eric, this next step is not for everyone, at least for now. Karen and Colleen, only those who are 50 and older or have weakened immune systems are eligible for this round. I spoke with a couple of doctors about this earlier today, and they say this is a move they expected. A little more than two years into the pandemic, certain Americans will soon be getting their second COVID-19 boosters. I am supportive of it. We are having more BA.2. It's more transmissible. We really have to pay attention to it, and we really have to think about offering another layer of protection uh, to older individuals and those with at-risk conditions. Following FDA approval, the CDC is recommending a second booster of the Pfizer or Moderna vaccines for people 50 and older or those who are immunocompromised. Ohio Health Infectious Disease Specialist Dr. Joseph Gastaldo says this probably won't be the last round of boosters we see. This virus is not going away. I get a flu shot every year. Uh, we have flu shots uh, that are recommended for everybody six months and older every year. Uh, and I do think that eventually when it's all said and done, there's going to be a regular schedule or regular cadence for us to receive a, a COVID booster. As for the second booster, both Dr. Gastaldo and the OSU Extra Medical Center's Dr. Carlos Malvasuto expect it'll probably be available to younger populations in a matter of months. I suspect that that may be a discussion that we'll be having, you know, towards the end of the summer. Um, and then at that point, the question will be, uh, what will that um, booster look like? For those eligible now, the CDC says it needs to have been at least four months since first boosters. This is great that we have this, that, that we have the booster, but there's still a significant proportion of the population that has not been vaccinated at all, right? And those are the patients that I worry about because those are the patients that I still see coming into the hospital. And the doctors say a second booster should be a no brainer for some while it is not as pressing for others. They also say a call to your doctor never hurts. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Eric Halpern, NBC4. Eric, thank you.